right, guys, first off on the list is Parrot. You guys know these guys. They make all kinds of applications for hands-free stuff. You guys know me. I've got one inside of my car for talking on my phone so I don't get a ticket. And today we're with Theodore, who's going to explain a brand new product that's great for in-home use. It's for watering and taking care of your plants. So let's let Theodore explain this great new product. Hello. So it's a uh, flower power. This is a Bluetooth Smart uh, plant sensor. So basically it's going to keep your plants alive. So how? So you have here uh, four, a system of four sensors and the first one here, the first sensor is a light sensor you have a uh, thermometer, thermometer uh, for here the um, soil moisture and here the fertilizer sensor. So this one will come on like if your light, if it doesn't get sunlight it'll give you a warning saying your plants are exactly, getting sunlight? Exactly, this is what we are, we are going to see here. So here, uh, first what you have to do is to pick up the plants, your plants. So to, Okay, if this one is going to describe uh, your plants very slow, uh, very quick. And here you have the four things that are going to measure watering, sun exposure, temperature, and fertilizer. So, how many plants do you are in here to choose from? So, the database? so, for the database, you have 6,000 plants. 6,000 plants? 6,000 plants. Wow. Everything's in English. Okay. And here? I'm familiar with that language, by the way. I think so. Uh, there are a lot of people here. So when you put it, so when you put it on on, on the soil, you will have uh, after 15 minutes the first uh, result. So everything here seems to be okay. Everything is green. And then after a while, your plants will have some needs, like here, uh, water. Um, so here it's telling you that in two days it would need some uh, some water watering, and if you forget to no, the watering, does it also tell you to over water? Uh, this is something that we are planning to integrate also in, because there is a big demand for that, yes. So all the reefs in the soil and everything, they'll come from these two meters that are right here on, on this as well, right? Yes, correct. Yeah. Can it work in, in all types of different soil, including like rocks and type stuff, or strictly just dirt? It, no, you need, you need uh, to have soil yeah. at soil, minimum. Okay. And here you can see that the, the big warning is telling you that you have to feed me right away, otherwise I die. Okay. <laughs> okay? I need one of those for my cat. Yeah. <laughs> and the last point, after one week, is going to construct a kind of uh, a history of your plants, so you'll be able to predict the needs of your plants. So, for instance, in one week you, you, you have to feed. Oh, so, so it'll basically show me like before every three weeks or whatever it needed watering. So it'll tell me that it's going to do like, like pre-prediction. Yes, exactly. Okay. And uh, very good, very good, uh, especially when you planning to go outside to go abroad for one month, and then you can say, okay, in one week I have to feed my plants. In two weeks I have to put a fertilizer. And then in advance you can call your friend. Okay, can you go? My to my apartment and put some more water. Let me ask you another question though. With like hydroponic gardens and stuff like that, they have these that can actually hook up directly. Do you guys have any plans of actually integrating software that could be on like an auto run watering program? Uh, this is maybe the second step, but uh, today we are not working on that. Yes. This is this basic home unit. Exactly. Okay. All right. Well, thank you very much, Theodore. Thank you for the time. All right, guys, you guys see it. Keep your plants healthy. Go with Parrot. We'll see you guys later.